big fumes in this episode we are going to edit any product details in our e-commerce api application okay so with that i'm your host sarthak and this is the channel where i talk about laravel and the cool thing about laravel so if you are new to this channel don't forget to subscribe and like bitfumes on facebook twitter and instagram let's see how we can update so to update we firstly need any route so let's check what the route we need php artisan route colon list and here we have the list of the routes we have so to edit you can see uh, here we have update products dot update this is the route and actual route is api slash product slash id of the product that's very nice so let's go and i will say obviously we have to start the server so let's start server so i will open new tab i will say php action search that's why great so now i will go to this e api products and we have this product create what i will do i will just save as this link to product update inside e api product and save to products but we have to provide the id of the product that's very nice and now header everything is good and now for the body you can see iphone 8 is that so let's first check what the id of that iphone 8 data we have so here we have e api product 104 okay so make it 104 instead of 4 104 iphone 8 and then i will say updated okay so send this let's see what we are getting we are getting some kind of error method not allow because we have to say not post but a put request why put request because this products dot update has a put request here that's great now if i send this we are getting nothing 200 okay status is good why is that because in our controller if i go to app http controllers and the product controller here on the update method we have nothing so we just want to update but let's see what we are getting so return request all and now go to postman send this yes we are getting data that's nice so let's now go and say product is equal to firstly we have already this product okay so what we can do we can just try to return and see what we are getting on the product so once again send this and we are getting the old data so this means in the request we have the new data here we have the old data so why not do this so product arrow here we can say update and dollar request arrow all and because we are using here mask assignment we can go to product model and here we have to say protected dollar fillable and we have to provide the fillable keys and which is simply the name of the product then details then i think the stock we have and price we have and discount we have so that should be discount okay and what is problem here problem is we have to say is equal to okay that's very nice and now let's see go to postman hit send and we are getting nothing okay let's go to database refresh it and you can see 104 at the last iphone 8 updated so if i try to get 104 and send it yes we are getting this updated part and remember that if i only provide uh, let's say i provide this description only so that will be like this okay and there will be no 
so I will say best phone and charging again updated simple so send this okay this means this time why description is not updated this is because in our table it's not description it's actually uh, details so here we have provided details but it's not even detail it's only detail so that's good and we have in our request description so why not we can give firstly request then detail is equal to request arrow description and then we can remove that here i will say unset and what we have to unset request then description we have moved the data of description into details so now that will be fine and now if i send update from here it will update i think surely send and yes we have updated thing that means description is also updated instead we have provided here details by doing all these steps so obviously at last we have to provide the response like this we have so let's go and provide the response response is simple as always nothing to change let's go once more send and we are getting all these things iphone 8 name is updated description of this phone is also updated but i think there is problem what is the problem here is that anyone can update any product so this problem i will tackle in i think after one episode because the next one will be for delete how we can delete or destroy a product so we will meet in the next episode before that don't forget to subscribe like bit tunes on facebook twitter and instagram so let's do our git part so here let's say first we clear that git status that's good then git uh, add all git commit hyphen m and product update that's okay then git push once more this is going to be okay that's nice and here i will say bitumes not bitumes github that slash bitumes slash api and now here 13 commits and last one so wait for next episode and bye bye